you know, my question for the Orlando massacre is this. I was part owner of clubs in the 90s. My partners own clubs. And, um, you know, I've just been affiliated with clubs. I used to do promotions and all that stuff, uh, bring people to Richmond. And my thing is this. I've seen people get in the club with handguns. That's, that's a given. And knives. But, bruh, AR-15, that joint got to be three to four feet long. How in the world a man get in a club with a three to four foot rifle that he got? He can't put it on his pants. How he get in that club with that gun? And he, he don't even own it. Like, he ain't even with the team that own it. There's something different. He coming in the back door performing. But one thing they ain't talking about is how that man got that gun in the club in the first place. You taking a gun in a, 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 a loaded uh, building full of people drunk and alcohol everywhere. Nobody's, that thing had to be staged, bro. How that man get that gun in that club? And he had to go through the front door because he ain't know nobody. They, they said they ain't even know who he was. So he ain't, ain't like he got no plug. How, they, ain't nobody talking about how that man, they talking about everything else. But they not saying how he got that three foot rifle and that 45 in a nightclub. When all nightclubs pat you down, man. Because it's alcohol in there. They got to. If this was, if that would have happened in Virginia, the nightclub owner would have got the same charges he got. And being that he did, the nightclub owner would have got all the murder charges. All them gun charge, they gave him a gun charge for everybody that got shot. Um, either got malicious wounding or attempted murder for everybody that got shot. Got the murder charge for all them people. He got the murder charge for dude, because they would have told him, dude wouldn't be dead or been in here shooting nobody if you ain't let him in with that gun. And they would have fried the club on him. You ain't even heard shit about the club on him. And you ain't heard nothing about the security. And you definitely ain't heard nothing about how that nigga got that motherfucking gun in there.